long, a long journey to kind of get to a point where there is equal amounts of headliners to choose from in every category. But at the moment, we've, we're proud to have got where we are. And we've got a female legend as well. And we've got a really diverse lineup this year. The whole lineup is so diverse, so exciting that I feel really, really happy with it. Yeah. Well, I think the lineup reflects what's happening in the music world. At the moment, there aren't a, there aren't a lot of like new rock acts to choose from, if I'm honest. Um, and you know, hopefully that will emerge again. I mean, I my heyday was 1995 with Pulp and Oasis and Radiohead and all those other bands, and um, and that was great. Music it changes all the time, and right now this is where we're at. We're reflecting what's happening, and every year. We've been criticised for being too rock, too grime, too hip hop, too pop. It's everything. Too guitar, too white guitar. Not enough this, not enough that. It's just part of our year now. I, I take the, I take that as just an, a part of our annual setup. We, when we announced the, um, the lineup, we expected to get. I always expect to get a little bit of kickback, <laughs> and generally. It's not from the public, so I think everybody's really happy and excited to be here. And I can see, I, you know, I, I can see talking to people, everyone's, they're just joyful and they're so lovely and they're so up for it and they're not critical and judgmental. And I think that's the best thing about the Glastonbury crowd.